Number 16. A can contains 375 milliliters of soda. How much is left after 308 milliliters is removed? All right, so this question is fairly straightforward, right? So let's, we can come up with a very simple formula here. So the amount you start with, right? The amount you start with subtracted by the amount removed shall equal the amount left. Cool, so sounds like we can just plug these in, right? So it says it initially contains 375 milliliters. That's the initial amount or the amount that you started with. Then it's asking, uh, it's telling us that we removed 308 milliliters. And finally, it says how much is left, right? How much is left after that's removed? So therefore that's the question actually we're trying to solve. So let's just plug in the numbers. So we have 300 and, oops, 375 milliliters minus 308 milliliters will equal now. So just plug it into your calculator. 375 minus 308 comes out to be 67 milliliters. And that would be the final answer. Just remember one thing, guys. When you do additions and subtractions and whatnot, you have to make sure that the units are consistent. Um, so if they gave you a milliliter value for the amount you started with, and then let's say a liter value for the amount you removed, um, you would have to do a conversion in that problem. You would either have to convert one value or all of them to liters or all of them to milliliters. It doesn't matter which one um, as long as they're consistent. So just keep that in mind. Thank you guys very much. And uh, remember, subscribe. Thank you.